Hello Brick Smarties, Brick Smarty here. So today I'd like to introduce part 2 in my Monsters of the Deep series. This video is also part 14 in my LEGO Deep Sea Creatures series. It features 10 original MOC alternates of the LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures set. This series is by far the most popular one I've posted, so I'll keep going as long as I can keep thinking up enough ideas. The LEGO Deep Sea Creatures set only has 230 pieces, so as the size and complexity of the models grow, so does the number of sets needed. So most of the MOCs in this series use not one, not two, but three Deep Sea Creatures sets, with the exception of the Bloop and the Sea Dragon that use four, and Blue which uses just one. This has made the whole project a mammoth task, and over the last five weeks I've created bigger models with a total of over 5,200 pieces and over 2,700 pages of instructions. Well, these MOCs are some of the biggest and most interesting I've ever produced, so hopefully it was worth the effort. Before I get any further into this, I would like to thank everyone who subscribed and for getting involved with all your comments and suggestions. Please keep them coming. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to BrickSmart Workshop so you don't miss any of my new LEGO MOCs. And a special thank you to those of you who head over to Rebrickable and buy some of my lovingly created instructions on there. And if you've got suggestions for part 15 or 16 in the Deep Sea Creatures series, part 3 in the Majestic Tiger series, or any of my other series, please let me know in the comments below or hit me up on Instagram and get sneak peeks of what I'm working on right now. OK, let's get back to the Monster of the Deep MOCs. The 10 MOCs in the series are the Sea Dragon, Lizzie the Super Croc, the Three Headed Shark, Whale Wolf, the Bloop, the Brickleback, the Purple Crustacean, the Red Bluster, Blue, and Demiking. And if you're not familiar with any of these monsters, stick around and all will be revealed. Also coming up later in the video is the digital build for Demiking. So if you have three LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures sets, you can follow along with the video, or come back later when you do. Or, if you prefer to work from PDF instructions that look like this, you can support me and buy them at rebrickable.com, just follow the link in the description below. So let's take a look at the Monster of the Deep MOCs. First up is the Sea Dragon. This Sea Dragon is inspired by artwork of ocean dragons, sea dragons and sea wings. It lives in the oceans, can swim and breathe underwater, but can also fly above the water and create huge waves with its tail. If you love dragons, monsters, and the LEGO Deep Sea Creatures set as much as I do, then this beast will be one you need to build. Building this dragon was a real challenge with the LEGO 31088 set because of the long neck, tail and wings and the lack of load-bearing Technic joints like there are in the Majestic Tiger set. So I built this beast as big as I could, then hollowed out the head and adjusted the build so it can be posed securely. But all the joint pieces you use must be fairly new and stiff. I used parts from four LEGO 31088 sets but I'm not going to lie, there are quite a lot of leftover pieces. Next we have Lizzie, the evolved mutant super croc from the hit action movie Rampage starring Dwayne Johnson. The beast started out as an American crocodile from the Everglades National Park that was exposed to Energene's Project Rampage pathogen after its orbiting research lab exploded in the Earth atmosphere and pathogen capsules fell to Earth. The pathogen infected the crocodile, mutating and weaponizing its DNA, along with Ralph the Wolf and George the Gorilla, the resultant monster grew rapidly to over 200 feet in length and developed additional tusks, neck frills, spikes and a spiked club for a tail. I've used three LEGO 31088 sets to do justice to the size and detail required for such an impressive monster and it was a lot of fun to build. I hope you enjoy building it too. Next comes the three-headed shark. Ever since I created a two-headed shark, I've been getting requests for a three-headed shark. So here it is. This frightening fictional creature is the star of its own sci-fi B-movie, Three-Headed Shark Attack, released in 2015. Since then, there have been five-headed and six-headed shark attack sequels, but no plans as yet to follow this theme. I've had to use three LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures sets to create the three shark heads, and this has given me a lot more pieces to make the body and fins bigger and longer, and even to create two tails. It uses over 500 pieces, and the instructions have 300 steps. I've had a lot of fun with this build, so I hope you enjoy building it too. Next is the Werewolf. 
The werewolf is a huge four-legged creature that stars in the 2015 sci-fi channel B-movie Sharktopus vs. Werewolf. A mad scientist combines DNA to create this monster with the body of a wolf, the fins of a killer whale and the brain of a human. I wouldn't waste any time on this movie, but you've got to love the creature design. A similar creature features in Inuit folklore, Aklut, a spirit that takes the form of a killer whale-wolf hybrid. I've been requested to build this beast a number of times, so here it is. I've used three LEGO 31088 sets to do justice to the size and detail required for such a monster, and it was certainly fun to build. I hope you enjoy building it too. Next up is the bloop. The bloop originated as a sound that was recorded using underwater microphones in the Pacific in 1997. This never before recorded noise was particularly loud and had a characteristic bloop sound to it. Many theories were suggested for the cause of this noise, including the possibility of a previously undiscovered deep sea creature that was larger than any other. Years later, scientists discovered the noise was actually the sound of a huge iceberg cracking and breaking away from an Antarctic glacier. But by that point, the legend of this giant underwater creature was already established, with wonderful images appearing online of a huge shark-like creature with a whale-like tail and a cavernous mouth swallowing sharks, whales and ships whole. And so was born the Bloop. I've used four LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures sets to try and do justice to the scale of this legendary beast. I've included a representation of the Bloop sound wave emanating from its mouth and a stand that allows it to tip back as if ascending from the depths below. I've left the internal structure of the main body section completely hollow, so if you remove the Bloop sound wave, you can have fun hiding a couple of fully loaded treasure chests, also from this set, inside its belly. I've had a lot of fun creating this monster from the deep. I hope you have fun building it too. Next comes the Brickleback, the first of four creatures from the same movie. The Brickleback is the first creature encountered in Netflix 2022 animated movie, The Sea Beast. It's a huge green deadly sea beast with spiked body sections and long whipping tentacles. Its segmented outer shell provides a tough armour while its snapping jaws get to work. Even when you think he's been contained, those long whipping tentacles can still pose a deadly threat. I've had a lot of requests to build the Brickleback as an MSC alternate of the 31088 Deep Sea Creatures set. The obvious issue with this is that the Brickleback is green and the Deep Sea Creatures set is mostly dark blue. So I created a 3 to 1 31088 version that uses three sets and a second version where I have replaced all the dark blue pieces and a couple of other key pieces with green ones. All these pieces are commonly available and it didn't cost much to order the extra parts from bricklink.com. Both versions and part lists are included in the rebrickable listing. Next up is the purple crustacean. The purple crustacean is a massive crab-like creature encountered in Netflix 2022 animated movie The Sea Beast. The purple crustacean is a massive crab-like creature and is also encountered in Netflix 2022 animated movie The Sea Beast and is the focus of a super cool mega monster fight when it encounters Red, the Red Bluster. Maybe the name isn't the most catchy, so feel free to call it Krabby McCrabface like my kids do. It has huge pincers and was reportedly based on a Japanese spider crab, but it has a circular mouth with rings of spikes rather like that of a sandworm in Dune or Sarlock in Star Wars. In keeping with the other monsters in the movie, it has a distinctive colour, purple. This one does still look pretty good in the dark blues and reds of the LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures set, and I used three sets to create it. I've also included instructions to replace most of the visible parts with purple alternatives. Please be aware, some of these purple parts are not super common, but I was able to require the necessary to build it via Bricklink. I was really happy with this model turned out, so whichever colour version you choose to build, I hope you have fun building it. Next is the Red Bluster. The Red Bluster, or Red, is the real star of Netflix 2022 animated movie, The Sea Beast. It's a mammoth-sized creature with a thick red-coloured hide, yellow cat-like eyes, and a giant horn adorning its head. Dubbed red by the young girl Maisie, the Bluster is not the ferocious creature that most have presumed her to be. Once reformed sea monster hunter Jacob and Maisie learn how to communicate with Red, they form a bond with the beast who saves them from enemy monsters and allows them to travel the sea on her back. The movie is worth a look, so no further spoilers here. The movie design team looked at real animals such as sea lions, whales, seals and walruses to aid in Red's creation. In the rare moments when you can see Red's entire form outside of the water, 
she does indeed have flipper-like appendages that are similar to these ocean animals. I also hope to create a creature that could look fearsome and gentle at the same time, and that could convert from its horizontal swimming form to its raised position where it props itself up on its flippers. I had a lot of requests to create the Red Bluster as an MOC alternate of the 3188 Deep Sea Creatures set. The obvious issue with this is that the Red Bluster is red and the Deep Sea Creatures set is mostly dark blue. So I created a 3 to 1 31088 version that uses three sets and a second version where I've replaced all the dark blue pieces and a couple of other key pieces with red ones. All these parts are commonly available and it didn't cost much to order the extra parts from bricklink.com. Both versions and part lists are included in the rebrickable listing. Next up is Blue. Blue also features in Netflix 2022 animated movie The Sea Beast. It's a cute, rounded, jelly-like creature that Maisie adopts as her pet. It has huge eyes that only make it look more cute and small flippers and fins so it moves a little like a seal. Except when it kind of rolls and slides. I've had so many requests for Blue and so many requests for MOCs made with just one LEGO 31088 set that this is what I set out to achieve. Blue is quite small, but even so it was quite a challenge to create it with just one set and make it look cute. I also wanted to make it so that when its mouth is closed, the teeth are hidden, and when it opens wide, they become visible. In keeping with the other MOCs from the Sea Beast movie, I've created a different color version if you wish to order the parts from Bricklink rather than using one LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures set. Both version and parts lists are included in the rebrickable listing. Enjoy! And last but not least is Demiking. Demiking is an extraterrestrial snail-like kaiju that appeared in the 2009 kaiju film Demiking the Sea Monster. Terrible movie, so don't waste your time on that, but awesome sea monster. This beast falls to earth inside a meteor. He's huge, I mean huge, and he breathes great long blasts of fire. So here he is. I've used three LEGO 31088 Deep Sea Creatures sets to do justice to the size of this thing. He feels very different from anything I've done before and is very funny to pose with those eyeballs on stalks. This is the model I'm going to build for you today, so I hope you have fun with this one. Let me know how you get on. Let's make a start with the Demiking build now.
And that's the Demo King build. Look out for more LEGO 31088 Monster of the Deep digital builds over the coming weeks. If you can't wait, or if you'd rather work from instructions that look like this, you can buy them at rebrickable.com, just follow the link in the description below. And don't forget to look me up on Instagram for more good stuff and behind the scenes photos. And use the hashtag BritSmartWorkshop to tag your photos so I can see your creations. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. You made it this far, so why not give us a like or make a comment below? Click here if you'd like to see more of the LEGO Deep Sea Creatures series, or here if you'd like to see some of my other LEGO Digital Creature builds. And don't forget to subscribe to BrickSmart Workshop so you don't miss any of my new MOCs. Yeah.